Hi there, it's Karen Reeder with ReadGab. The book I want to recommend for you today is called Ophi's Ghosts. Ophi's Ghosts is such a fantastic book. It's got historical fiction, it's got mystery, a little bit of horror because it's got these ghosts, and it is a perfect middle grade book for kids. I think it would be such a fantastic read aloud for kids and to do tie-ins with history and issues of race and how they were back then and also how they are now or to do with the reading groups with kids. So much great discussion you can do here. So Ophi, when she's 12 years old, she's living with her family in Georgia. And one night, everything changes for her. Everything changes. Her father appears to her, and she doesn't realize it at first because she didn't know until this moment that she can see and communicate with ghosts. And so her father appears to her because he was just lynched for voting. And so, he tells her to run and she takes her mom and they run and hide. And then the men who killed her father come and they burn down her house. And so Ophi and her mom have to get out of town. So not only did they lose her father, she's lost her home and everything that she knows. And so they go north to Pittsburgh. Things are rough there. Her mom used to do hair, but she's not able to do it and make enough money in Pittsburgh. And so her mother is now working for the Carruthers at Daffodil Manor. Poor Ophi has to stop going to school, which she loves, and she's got to go spend her days working as a maid for this very honorary, mean old woman. And she discovers that this house, more so than many, is haunted by many different ghosts. And she is warned by her aunt to, you know, not befriend the ghosts and not to trust the ghosts. But against the better judgment of her aunt, Ophi does make friends with a ghost named Clara. And so the story goes on to try, she's trying to figure out how Clara was murdered. And the things just keep getting a little crazier and crazier. She's learning about why these ghosts are hanging on and what happened to Clara because she's trying to piece it together. And it, it's such an exciting book. The character Ophi is so well written. Justina Ireland is the author and Oh my gosh, you just love this character, Ophelia. You connect with her and you just want to become her best friend. She's she's just such a fantastic character. And so I love the character. I love the development. I love the dialogue. It flows so well. It's one that I really wanted to just keep reading. I listened to it on an audiobook and it was such a fantastic listen. And it it is it's fun as everything comes together in the end. It is an excellent book, so I hope that you will share it with some of the kids in your lives or read it for yourself. This is one that I enjoyed myself that I would have just read anyways. And I hope you will take the time to support me by subscribing to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up, share it with others. And I look forward to talking to you soon and sharing more books with you. Bye.